Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you my G-Shock 3.0 in Builder Book for Cheshire. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, I would really appreciate it. And it really helps me out a lot to make more amazing content for you guys. If you're not joining our Discord server, the link is down below. But yeah, let's get into the showcase. So first off over here we have our very basic shield. But the very special thing about this is if you select all, a lot of layers of gold there. Very powerful against mini guns. They basically don't even affect the shield. I tested it with my friend the other day, and yeah, it took him so long to destroy it. Next over here, we have a sword. So yes, very cool looking sword. Not much, not very special, but yeah, pretty cool in my opinion. And of course, it has to have spikes on it for the damage and collision off, so it can go through builds. So next over here, unlike the other G sharks, he has claws. These don't do any damage yet, they're just for show, but I'm going to make them do damage very, very soon, and I'll show that to you guys in a part two. And then next off, we have the, what should I call these? Yes, lasers. We have the lasers, so we have four of the smaller ones, and then we have one big core laser, and then two smaller ones up there. And now let's go to the back. So up, oh, why did I go inside there? Technical difficulties. Alright, anyways, up here we have his blasters. I've taken these from Juggernaut. I've forgotten how to make them spin though, but I'm sure I'll be able to pretty easily fix that. So he's got two of these and they both fire about 60, 70 cannons in total. So very powerful. And then this is his jetpack. So basically very similar to G-Man's jetpacks. Two of these rocket booster things. Wait a minute. So yeah, as I was saying, the jetpack's very similar to G-Man's, but let's move on to the shark head at the top. So I think I've mentioned this in another showcase before of G-Shark, but this was meant to be for another mech, but I basically just changed the colours up, and now it's basically part of this mech. So it has a laser beam at the top, which it can shoot out. So you can retract the laser beam back in, and then with the controls, you can just shoot it back out. Very powerful, has about like 80 or 90 spikes. But the jaw cannot work like this, so it's a bit sad. And at the top, we have a stun harpoon. So if you shoot someone with this harpoon and anchor it, it actually stops their build from moving. Or it will just fling their build. My friend built it for me, so shout out to him. And that's basically all of the body. And then down here, we have more lasers that are actually connected by this thing. I don't know what to call it, but yeah. And now let's showcase it, like the actual moving. Alright guys, so let's retract the laser beam. Just gotta wait for lag to lag, you get me? Alright, so first off, the shield is pretty powerful. It can move and it can cover the whole body. So you can protect the face or you can block like aerial attacks from jets and stuff. And if you want to, you can just place the shield here. So you can leave it there. So basically you you basically just attach it to this arm and then if you want you can just leave it out like this you can do it both ways next he also has a force field this is a more defensive character compared to the rest of my builds so yeah very defensive and he's got his force field and shield to protect against attacks now you can also take the force field back so yeah you can take the shield away as well and then this was meant to make the blaster spin, but for some reason it isn't working. If anyone knows how to fix it, uh, comment, you can use the name in the comments, I'll add you and you can come help me fix it and I'll give you a shout out. So this button is for the rapid shooting blasters. There's a bunch of delays, so yeah, you can shoot a lot of cannons very quickly. This is very powerful in PvP, so you can basically just spam like this. And it basically has no cooldown, click it again and you can just fire again. So yeah, very powerful indeed. Yeah, I can just spam. But anyways, let's move on to the sword. So for the sword, B and M, it can go up and down to slice people or slice builds. And then the thing, shield can also protect part of the sword like this. Or it can protect the blasters. And now time for the best attack, the laser beam. Just hold V and it fires very powerful very powerful attack indeed and then you can also just retract it back if you want 
And then like Juggernaut, he also kind of has the speed boost. Kinda. It works when it wants to. Yeah, there we go. Kinda. But because of the server lag right now, it's not going to work. So that's sad. But yeah, it's basically all for the showcase. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. I will really appreciate it and it really helps me out a lot. And yeah, hope you enjoyed and goodbye.